Return to the classroom. Students go back to school under the dark cloud of the Zika virus. Schools across South Florida opened their doors this morning while taking precautions against a virus that's a threat to our health and economy. Students are learning about long sleeves and bug spray as a new way of life. CBS 4's Hank Tester joins us live from Miami Beach. Hank. And it's hot wearing those uh, long sleeves and those long pants, but the kids apparently got the message. A lot of preparation got them ready for the first day of school, which, according to the superintendent, went real well right from the get-go. Let's take a look. Dr. Alberto Carvalho up early, not only opening the traditional first day of school at the district bus terminal, but also added to this agenda dealing with Zika in schools on Miami Beach and Wynwood. Regarding Zika, the best preparation is protection and the best prevention is uh, preparation. On this first day, students decked out in long sleeves and long pants, heeding the call of school officials to protect themselves from mosquito bites and the possibility of Zika transmission. This young man's wearing an insect repellent wristband. Because my mom told me to. The school superintendent spent a number of days making sure students had access to the proper clothing and mosquito spray. So how the Zika issue on top of the potentially stressful first day of school go? In the most impacted areas by the threat of Zika, we're talking about Wynwood and Miami Beach, attendance was actually higher today than the first day of school last year, which is interesting. The superintendent spent the day traveling to a number of schools where kids were properly clad with long sleeves and long pants. They really did make an effort here. They did, you know, give away long sleeve things as well. So. So they You're are ready. making it. Your daughter's ready. She's ready. Well, we're going to be visiting some great classrooms, great teaching, uh, first day of school, a lot of excitement, and uh, also to put the minds of parents, teachers, and students alike uh, at ease uh, regarding this uh, Zika scare. And a reminder to the parents, uh, do that spray before they go to school because they can't take the cans of spray to school. That's the very latest. I'm Hank Tester, CBS4. Back to you. Good to know, Hank. Thank you.